Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and to another video where today I'm going to go and watch Chester FC as they take on Chorley away from home in the National League North. Now, I'm really looking forward to this game tonight as not only is it my first time watching Chorley on the channel, whether that be home or away, uh, I'm ticking a new ground off the list, but also because I'm going to be stood with the Chester fans tonight in the away end. Uh, last time I watched Chester on the channel was about a month ago when I went to the Diva Stadium and saw Chester lose 1-0 in very controversial circumstances against AFC Fylde. If you've not seen that video, go and check it out. Uh, really really good video uh, loads of action in the game so yeah but come back to this one um should be a good video tonight um as i said stood with the chester fans who i've been reliably informed uh, uh you know they're really good away from home as well as at home from what i saw in that last video um during that game i was stood with my good friend alex bullions who's been on a couple of videos on the channel before but uh, i doubt he'll be making the journey up tonight um for the game considering you know he lives in essex and it's a bit of a journey all the way up to uh to chorley for you know on a tuesday night for him but yeah it should be a, a great atmosphere created by the other chester fans that you'll have seen in that video and uh, hopefully meet a few of them tonight as well but um looking at the table itself um after that game with Fylde, Chester was sat in the relegation zone, I believe. So they hadn't had the best starts to the season, but it's fair to say they've turned uh, turned things around since then. If I just get the table up now, if you bear with me one second, Chester are currently sat in 13th on 12 points, whereas Chorley are 8th um, with 13 points. So yeah, only a point difference between them. And uh, a win tonight for Chester would um, probably see them move up the table if results around them, you know, go for them. And they could be sort of knocking on that door for those um, those playoff spots. Obviously, it's early in the season still, you know, only 10 games in after tonight. But it's more like the start that Chester fans will have been hoping for. And yeah, hoping they can get the win tonight, considering, you know, I'll be stood with the Chester fans. But, you know, more than anything, hoping for a great atmosphere, loads of action, loads of goals, everything to bring you guys. But yeah, really looking forward to this one and we'll see you guys when we get down there.
Okay, so half time here, and it's currently Chorley nil, Chester one, and um, yeah, been a decent half that to be fair. Chester fans have been been loud considering it's a Tuesday night and everything they brought quite a few maybe 300 350 something like that but, um, good goal as well for Chester but you know hopefully they can hold on in the second half uh, they'll be shooting towards their fans in the second half but yeah as I said been decent so far hopefully Chester can uh, hold on for the win and uh, we'll see you on the other side at the time.
Okay. So full time here and I'm back in the car after the game. Um, brilliant second half that and it finished uh, Chorley 2, Chester 2. Um, and the, just the limbs when that second goal went in for Chester to put them 2-1 up. Um, the best by far that I've ever seen on this channel, full stop. Uh, there was a flare thrown onto the pitch, fans uh, running onto the pitch. It was just absolute carnage. And yeah, I just hopefully hopefully captured it well for you guys, but just an incredible atmosphere. Um, I said the Chester fans were, you know, in fine voice at half time, considering it's a Tuesday night. But yeah, it's just absolutely insane in that second half from from the Chester fans and to, to be fair you know Chorley fans weren't too bad themselves either they made a lot of noise when they scored their goals had a bit of a weird sort of pyro thing light uh, like sparkler thing going on uh, it was kind of funny um but other than that um yeah they created a really really good atmosphere from their end as well so yeah i can't complain great night of football uh doesn't do much for the table uh chester stay where they are in 13th and chorley move down two places into 10th so yeah doesn't do much for the table but a great night of football all round if you have enjoyed it please do not forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so you never miss an upload Thank you so much once again for watching and I'll see you in the next one, which I know I've been banging on about it, but I can't wait, is on Saturday. Clitheroe are playing in the FA Cup third qualifying round. They could make history if they beat Berry AFC at Shawbridge. It's going to be a great day. Hopefully Clitheroe can do it and, um, you know, make FA Cup history and get to the fourth qualifying round. It'd just be amazing. But yeah, um, I'll shut up about it now. That's for Saturday. I'll see you then. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.